Hey guys, Everything Apple Pro here, and as many of you guys know, yesterday on March 7th, iOS 5.1 was released, and the iPad 3 and Apple TV 3 were announced as well. Now, for those of you that did update despite the warnings and you still want to jailbreak, this video will show you guys how to jailbreak your iPhone 4, 3GS, iPod Touch 4th and 3rd Gen, and the original iPad. Now, this jailbreak will not work on any iPhone 4S, iPad 2, or of course a new iPad, and it is a tethered jailbreak, meaning if your battery dies or you need to reboot or turn off your iPhone, you will need a computer with Redstone installed nearby in order to boot it back on. Otherwise, it will be stuck just on the Apple logo. It is a minor inconvenience. Most of you guys won't even turn off your iPhones that often, but it is a temporary jailbreak for those of you that have updated to 5.1 on accident. Now, I also want to mention that if you guys have an iPhone 4S or iPad 2 on firmware 5.0.1, you can jailbreak it untethered using this program. It's a little bit different process than for the rest of us but you guys can jailbreak your 4s and ipad 2 on 5.0.1 all right guys so make sure your iDevice is plugged in and on your desktop you will need to download red snow 0.9.10 beta 6 you'll find links down below in the description as well as a written guide now go ahead and right click on red snow run as administrator if you guys are on windows of course and we're just gonna make sure our device is plugged in and we're gonna select jailbreak now this is where we power off our iPod. We're going to be putting it into DFU mode. And okay, so we're going to go ahead and click next and hold power for three, two, one, together with home for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, let go of the power button and keep holding the home button. Okay, so Red Snow has recognized our device. So give it about five to 10 minutes. And once it's done, I'll be right back. And there you go. My iPod has rebooted after the jailbreak. And if you guys slide to unlock, you will see Cydia on your springboard. It will be white for most of you. If you click on it, it will crash. So what I'm about to show you is basically what you guys have to do every single time your battery dies or you turn off your iDevice, you will have to go into Red Snow again back to the main menu click on extras and you're gonna select just boot tethered right now and then go ahead and put your iDevice into DFU mode so power it off first and then we're gonna click next hold power for three two one together with home for ten nine eight seven six five four three two one let go of the power button and keep holding the home button and there you go red snow has recognized our i device so give it about two to three minutes and i'll be right back once again now once your i device reboots go ahead and slide to unlock and on your springboard you will see a colored cydia click on it and you guys are now jailbroken on ios 5.1 now remember this is a tether jailbreak keep in mind if you do need to turn off your device make sure a computer is nearby with red snow installed and that's it guys you are now jailbroken tethered on 5.1 so i hope you enjoy this jailbreak guys of course please rate this video it does help a lot subscribe for more great videos and comment if you have any questions i will try to get to them and for the iphone 4s and iphone 4 unlockers your unlocks are coming very soon stay tuned for that the iphone 4s a little faster but of course i will keep you guys updated now again enjoy the jailbreak guys peace